Welcome back to The Breakdown with Luke. Today we're gonna to be diving into a 200 watt massive charging power station. Now this is a very nice little charging station with the ability to charge six devices at once, four USB-Cs, two standard USBs, and up to 200 watts max charging. Enough to max charge two 100 watt laptops at the same time through this. If you're like me and increasingly you're getting more devices, you have a tablet, wireless earbuds, a phone, maybe you got a Nintendo Switch or other devices, and a laptop that charges through USB-C. A device like this on your desk can max charge all that at once, or maybe on your nightstand next to you at night as you get ready for the day or wherever it may be, you can max charge all those devices at once through this single device here. A few catches here though. We want to break those down, make sure you understand what you're buying to make sure this can actually do what you want it to do with that. Before we get into all that, a few disclaimers. This was not a review unit. I did buy with my own money to use myself, honestly, and to give you a full review. Second, pricing on this changes so rapidly. Hate to give you a price and have it be wrong. I'll put a link to it in the show notes and in the first pinned comment so you can find it there for yourself and decide if it's right for you. If you're new here, do me a big favor. Hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, let YouTube know you enjoy it. Um, and again, enjoy what we do so they recommend our videos to more people. And again, if you wanna find this on Amazon, check out the show notes and in the first pinned comment. With that said, let's dive into it. Starting off, just take a look at the front here. Pretty standard, four USB-Cs, two standard USBs. On the back is where you plug in the cable, which makes travel very nice. Now this is pretty hefty. <laughs> it's one of the heftiest chargers I've ever tested, weight-wise. So keep that in mind if you're very sensitive to weight as you're trying to pack maybe a, a, a suitcase to travel with or something. This is pretty hefty. I do like the silvery color, and then it's kind of got a shiny, glossy black finish on the front. Let's take a look at everything that came with us as I break down a few important things you need to know. Starting off with the fact that this is a 200 watt max, which can be divided into two 100 watt chargers. The problem is, so you can charge two 100 watt laptops, maybe you're somebody who always is working on laptops. You wanna make sure you have a little dock there. You can just plug your um, laptops you're working into on the, into this to rapidly charge them. Now the problem with that is it's only two. Once you plug in an additional device, you can't, it starts dividing out. So it's 200 watts, but divide it out. So with six different plugs, if you plug all them in, you're not even gonna get 100 watts out of each port. So it's important to know that. Um, now, if you're using this to maybe charge one laptop and three phones, for example, and maybe a Nintendo Switch, this is a great device for that. You have a lot of ability to charge many things. You can easily charge a family's devices. I have two kids, my spouse and I, we travel with a lot, a lot of electronics, two tablets, Nintendo Switch, wireless earbuds, a couple phones, and more. Well, when I get to the hotel, if I set this up, this can charge all that at once without problems. I don't have to think about, man, all right, I need a charger for each device, or maybe I, this is a three port charger, so I need to rank through two or three of them. This is a pretty hefty little device that allows me to charge everything at once through six different charging ports at once. I really do like it. Again, though, the catch is it's 200 watts max. Now it can power up to two 100 watt devices. 100 watts is the max out, I believe, according to our testing. I was able to max charge my um, a Lenovo Yoga laptop, that's a USB-C charger, 100 watts, and my Pixel 8, and a Nintendo Switch, all from a single device through this. So I really do like it. In our testing, everything worked as it should without problems. As long as you're aware of the limit, you're not going, for example, get 200 watts from each port. This isn't going to do two 120, 140 watt devices at once, but if you understand that limitation, I think you're gonna be very happy with it. So two thumbs up, would recommend, link in the show notes down below and in the first pinned comment. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, we would really appreciate your support. Until next time, take care, be safe.